This Olympic Games will be like no other. It will be my first as captain of our Olympic team and we can't wait to walk onto the pool deck, sing the national anthem and make our country, our families, our friends and our water polo community proud. It's my honour as captain of the Aussie Sharks to introduce the new team for the Tokyo Olympic Games and for you to hear just how much it means to us to wear the green and gold. Oh, to become an Olympian, I mean, to play the sport you love and then on top of that to, to go on to represent Australia with a bunch of your mates, um, it's, yeah, it's really special. It's going to sum up my whole career, singing that national anthem. It's a dream come true really, isn't it? Um, you know, to play all these years with some of the closest friends. Knowing that this could be the last time that you sing it, it's, it means it's a big thank you to everyone that's been there for me. To get a medal at those major tournaments is great, um, but to do it at the Olympics, that's why we're here. I think about this all the time. I get goosebumps. Chasing that goal with a team, that's sort of, it's an addictive feeling. And once you sort of get that feeling, then it's really, that's what you want to chase. They send photos through. Yeah. It's definitely the love. <laughs> Sending love from all the family, mum and dad. It's pretty easy to say that without them, I wouldn't be sitting here today. I mean, they're my biggest support network. Like, they're pretty much everything, you know? They love you, Dad. Oh, <laughs> oh, God. You know, it's, you sort of do it for for your mum and dad and all the spectators up in the in the crowds and your teammates and your coaches and um, I think this one will be a little bit different. Um, yeah, definitely be thinking of, of both of them uh, very much so. This is a thing that you sit up and dream about uh, every night and we really want to go out there and, and do something special. Knowing how proud mum and dad will be, that'll be what makes it so special. They've done absolutely everything they can for me in life and you know, I hope if I have kids one day then I can be you know, it's important to them as they are to me. I clearly remember vividly uh, the moment where um, I was maybe 15 or 16, there was this big banquet. The host kind of said at the beginning, can I please ask all the Olympians to stand up? And everyone was clapping and I remember at that moment, I, I you know, I, I still get the shivers from it. This is what we all been dreaming about, to kind of get that medal of honor, be, becoming Olympian kind of, uh, makes it all worth it, makes it all special and, and really puts uh, uh, puts meaning to, to all the sacrifice and, uh, and, and all the work that you've been putting in since, since, you know, I knew how to pronounce my name, so. Getting that call to go to the Olympics is just step one of a long, a what's been a long journey and I think we can do something special absolutely this time and so the call, it's definitely only the beginning. <laughs>